Prince Harry and Meghan Markle step out together holding hands. They're kicking off their royal tour in Africa. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are melting hearts everywhere on the first day of their royal tour of South Africa. They arrived at the Nyanga Township hand in hand, ready to take a workshop run by Justice Desk, which teaches children about their rights, self-awareness and safety. Their son Archie was left with a nanny for the visit. The Duchess of Sussex wore a black and white print wrap dress designed by Maya Miko, a Malawi fair trade brand, as she joined her husband in meeting the locals. The pair were given a vibrant welcome from well-wishers, sharing hugs with children and dancing to music before they entered the Nyanga Methodist Church. Meghan and Harry looked as loved up as ever, sweetly put their hands on each other's backs and smiling widely as they moved through the event. They also gave a speech, with Harry speaking first. I wanted to ensure that our first visit as a family, with my wife by my side, focused on the significant challenges facing millions of South Africans, while acknowledging the hope we feel so strongly here, he said. We are so incredibly grateful to be able to listen and learn from you about the issues that define your daily lives in these communities. And that's what this is, a community. A community where men and women have a vital role to play. Touching on what your president said last week, no man is born to cause harm to women, this is learned behavior and a cycle that needs to be broken. So now, it's about redefining masculinity, it's about creating your own footprints for your children to follow in so that you can make a positive change for the future. To me, the real testament of your strength isn't physical. It's what's up here and what's in here. Your strength is in your spirit, which for me means honoring and protecting my wife, and being a positive role model for my son. Meghan, who, like baby Archie, is visiting South Africa for the first time, also shared a few words, telling the crowd. And just on one personal note, may I just say that while I am here with my husband as a member of the royal family, I want you to know that for me I am here with you as a mother, as a wife as a woman, as a woman of color and as your sister. I am here with you and I am here for you and I thank you so much for showing my husband and I the spirit of Ubuntu and I look forward to our time over the next few days together. The family will also tour the District 6 Museum later to learn about the history of Cape Town and will meet former residents. What's more, they will also be visiting the homecoming center an annex of the museum where they can take part in a cooking activity to showcase the cultural diversity of the area. The royal couple will spend a few days touring Cape Town before the Duke of Sussex embarks on a solo trip to Botswana, Angola, and Malawi.